Hey guys, so today with Nick, and today we're going to go over my settings for Battlefield 2042. A comment on one of my videos asking for this, so uh, we'll be getting in here and uh, showing my comments. Oh god, comments. We'll be showing my settings for uh, the game and my keybinds and all that, so uh, let's just get into it. Alright, so first things first, let's get into the uh, display settings here, and you might be wondering, why does my game look so different in all my gameplays? And that's because I actually run this game at stretched resolution. Uh, normally in my gameplays I'll actually be running this, but I changed it recently to this. Just to see how I like it. Um, these are my graphical settings. I run 100 uh, field view. Uh, don't paint it to vehicles. I just put a random one on. Uh, I put this on. 50 uh, brightness, you know, that crazy. Make sure you take off motion blur because motion blur is just annoying. And then just all those settings. Uh, no, nothing crazy here. I did change this, but for whatever reason, it did get uh, reset. I uh, did change that. Uh, for your uh, kill feed, make sure it shows squad and nearby. I think it defaults to squad in the game. So you're just more aware of what's going on. Say you see um, Jim Bob, you know, 33, and you do damage to him, right? And then you see, like, you see his name, and then you see a teammate die. Right, so he's like, okay. Teammate probably hopefully shot him at some point. So you know he's he, you know he's kind of weak right or whatever, right? Uh, that's a terrible example, but you know, the point is you get more information, right? Um yeah, put that there. Uh crosshair and all that. This is what I have for all this. Uh maximum mini map size. Uh I didn't really tinker with this too much. Uh, I, actually, I did. I think this is another that I set. So yeah, it's weird. Uh, my volume. Uh, 2040 has amazing push-up audio. You don't even need to crank it up to 100. You know, you just crank it up to, you know, some random. And, um, yeah, uh, 3D headphones. Make sure you put this on so you get a better sense of where footstep sounds are coming from. So you just be more aware in-game. Uh, let's go into the keybinds. Now, you see 8 right here. Uh, obviously, I'm not going around and clicking 8 on my keyboard. Actually, this is bound to my mouse, to my front mouse button to be precise. I run a uh, Logitech Pro Wireless. That's the mouse I use, so it's bound to my front one. And then 0, as you see here, is bound to my uh, closest one to my to my hand. Uh, and then the rest of those are random. Oh, we're not going to move over vehicles because I'm not a pilot or anything. I don't know how to use them. Uh, I may get into the gunner seat if Phantasm is flying a helicopter, but other than that, you know, I don't really go in vehicles. Uh, movement, everything standard. Uh, my jump is scroll wheel up as an alternate jump. And then my prone is scroll wheel down. It's just to do some movement techs like uh, the dolphin dive and, and things like that. Uh, so I have those bound like that. Uh, this, I have it bound like this because I was testing something, so uh, don't worry about that. Um, everything else is standard. Uh, now for the gadgets, right, you see Specialist Gadget 3, Gadget V, and uh, Classic Gadget 4. Um, I actually come from uh, Battlefield 3 and 4, so that's my background. Um, at least on console, uh, the health is like 3, and then the D-pad is 4. You know, so, uh, I mean uh, left and right D-pad, sorry. And then on mouse keyboard, you know, 3, 4 is the translation. So that's how I have it. And then ammo box is the, I don't really need to use my ammo box all the time. So it's actually fun that it's just this um, button that's far away, not any of my immediate buttons. Uh, this is for health, and this is for reses or killing people if I want to troll someone. Uh, so yeah, that explains that. Uh, it also will change bending on the uh, the operator I'm playing. Say I am uh, playing Liz, it won't change at all. Everything will be fine, but say Boris, right? Obviously I want my rocket to be um, three because it's more familiar to me. So it would actually be Gadget 3, Class Gadget 4, the Special Gadget V. There we go. Uh, grenade is F. I'm actually considering putting this actually to my zero uh, mouse bind. Uh, just so, uh, because I don't really need to look around to melee, but holding my grenade and being able to look around, you know, and move around and stuff like that, I think would be beneficial. But, you know, we'll see. Uh, Colon Tablet, pretty much unbound, uh, technically. it's. I'll cross my keyboard, it's not bound to my mouse or anything like that. It's literally just, I don't really use it. But say if I wanted to use it, I can in the future of the game. Uh, Underbarrel, 
uh, if I happen to switch to a, um, a master key grenade launcher, you know, there it is. Uh, fire mode, B, nothing really right home about there. Uh, modify attachments is T. Now, I would recommend if you're just getting to the game, switch it to the middle mouse button. Uh, watch a video by, I believe, Enders who said to do that. The only reason why I don't do that is because I've been playing the game long enough to where it's just T, you know. Like, it's just, like, I was, because I switched it, obviously, uh, when I watched the video. And I just ended up pressing T a bunch. So I, I just kept it. And then it reset my key bind, so I never, you know, decided to just put it back. A uh, toggle scope. Uh, that should actually be H. Don't worry about that, and all that doesn't matter. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's my sensitivity. I guess you can talk about these things. There's more settings, right? Uh, yeah. Everything is just standard. Uh, double tap or it is off because it messes with uh, some of the advanced movement in the game. So I have that off. Uh, use transversal sprint. I have that off. It also messes with some movement. Uh, I have this off just so I can choose uh, when to uh, put my parachute and all that. Uh, same thing here. And same thing here so I can hold your knees and stuff like that more easier, you know. Things like that. So nothing crazy. And yeah, I know you saw this since it's so entirely just a complete mess, but I don't really use any uh, large sensitivity options. But yeah, that is it for the video. That is my settings um, video. I might do a uh, like a, a class setup thing if, if people care. Um, I don't think people care for, you know, my opinions on like the best class setups or anything like that. Um, but yeah, if, if you do want that though, you know, don't don't be afraid to say that in the comments, and I'll and I'll be sure to get on that uh, as soon as possible. Um, I might do a video on my feelings about the season so far. Um, that so that might be in the pipeline. Uh, another infantry highlight video definitely coming down the road. I've been busy playing Destiny 2 Lightfall that came out literally the same day as this season. And so I've been having fun with that. So uh, Battlefield has kind of been on the, on the back burner. Um, if I'm being honest, uh, the season is not, I feel like it's worse than the last one. It may be controversial opinion. I don't know how everyone feels about it. Um, but that's just my feeling that the map uh, is not as good as I would like it to be. God, I'm gonna go into a whole fucking review if I don't cut it off right now. But yeah, that is the video. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace.